Amazing. And we are live. Oh, wait. It's, is this a good center? I guess. You want to come scooch over here? There you go. Now we're center, I think. Right? Mm -hmm. All right. Feels good. All right. What's up, everybody? I'm Toya. And I'm Bella. And you are watching YouTube Live with Toya and Bella. So right now, is anybody with us? There we go. Hey! Okay, everybody's here. I was like, where's everybody at? I even forgot to come. What's up, Julie? What's up, Rihanna? What's up, Kenzie the Unicorn? How you doing? Hey, Jamie doll. What's up? What's up, Alicia Pinay? Did I say that right? Oh, you forgot to turn off your volume. Okay, what's up, uh, Mila, Kai, S uh, Selma, Batter, uh, what's up, Nicole? What's up, Samantha, Brent? Hi! Okay, so yeah. YouTube Live with Toya and Bella. So this week, we are gonna talk about our favorite video, and then we're gonna make mini beanies. Yes, mini beanies in real time. We've shown how to make miniature beanies before, but today we're gonna make it together. So all you gotta do is go and grab some little toddler socks, if you happen to have them laying around, if you don't, <laughs> yeah. Um, that tough. <laughs> stop it, you. <laughs> then you're gonna need a needle and thread, and some scissors, and that's all we need to make our mini beanies. Okay, first up is... Favorite video. Yes, favorite video. What was your favorite video this week? My favorite video this week was the Baby Yoda. Because it's Baby Yoda, and how could it not be your favorite video? The Child. You know the official name is The, the child. child. Because have they actually said it's Baby Yoda? I mean, can you do have to? Do they I, have to say? I don't think they have to, but he can't be the only one in his whole species. I think that's totally possible. I think so too. I'm assuming it's Baby Yoda. We're all assuming it's Baby Yoda. Watch it not be. Because he's got the force Watch and all. It. You know what it's going to be? It's going to be. It's Baby Yoda's dad. Yeah. Or it's going to be like not Yoda at all. That's what it's I'm saying. Like, it'd be like a Jabberwocky. Hi, Taylor. Wait, Jabberwocky is not. What's a Jabberwocky? Jabberwocky is the dancing girl. <laughs> okay, so yeah, we're just gonna say it's Baby Yoda. We don't have an actual confirmation on that, but we are saying it's Baby Yoda, and I am completely obsessed. So if you follow me on Instagram, you might notice that in my Instagram story, it keeps popping up in all of my posts. Yeah, because they have the cutest little gifts. Are they called gifts? Yes, yeah. gifts. They have the cutest little gifts of them, and I just put them everywhere because they're so Sharon cool. wanted us to acknowledge her, and she put mean faces. <laughs> What's up, Sharon? Smile! Look at the camera. Look at the camera. I keep looking there. I know, but there's no home button on this thing, so it's like, where are we supposed to? Yeah, I know. There's no. I can't even. I think... We're using a new tablet, and I can't see where the camera is. So I'm just. I just gotta know to look at that side of the tablet. Now I know how Android users feel. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, what's up, Carol? How you doing? So yeah, uh, you super rosy nine seven nine eight says they like our hair. Thank you so much. So yeah, this week we decided to do something a little different. And good thing we did because it's been raining literally all week. So I was like, bro, let me put on a beanie because I'm wearing hats now. I've been wearing beanies to school and our teachers don't even care. Because I'm in high school, even though, don't do that because it depending on your high school, they might care. My <laughs> high school don't care. So I've been wearing beanies like all day. And so yeah, the, the t these were actually the easiest hairstyle I have ever done. I am not gonna even lie. So if you are into like natural hairstyles or crochet braids or braids or whatever, faux locks, dude, it takes like- It literally took a day. It took me four hours. And that took me, it took me more than four hours because I restarted like three times. That's but true. if I hadn't restarted, I would have been done the same time she was done. From start to finish. I'm talking yeah. from detangling- From like wash to done. Four and, hours. Yeah. Never happened before. I'm never putting twists in ever again. <laughs> I'm always going to wear faux locks yeah. for like ever. I'm like, hey, where's that girl with the faux locks? Right here. And I'll get better at it. Right now, they're just kind of like whatever. But I don't know. It kind of added some little random curly mini dreads in there. I don't know. I was going for this mermaid vibe. Don't know if I got it, but working on it. Okay. So uh, Kay Caitlin L Miller loves our hair. Shout out to Alex Z. Marquez. What's up? And the Unicorn Collector play more Roblox. I actually was playing today because Royal High had an update and you go, when you spawn, you can spawn into an apartment now. 
really it's this crazy looking apartment and a really cool bathtub and i was in there chilling out in roblox i didn't record a video but i was just having fun because i do that sometimes it's getting really cold in here i know are you we did because it was messing up the sound okay so let's start on those mini beanies because i don't know how long they're gonna last you might be toes are freezing off it's cold outside <laughs> okay so pick a color first here we got our here are our socks so pick a sock any sock, any sock, pick one. Uh, blue. All right, and then I'm gonna go with, I guess, pink. Why does everyone tell me this color is green? This color is blue. That is green. This is blue. It's like a, it's, it's a green. It's like blue. It's like a it's green, green is like green. That's green. Okay, so this is green. This, for all of you out there, is a light purple. blue. Nope, nope. That's purple. This is the purple sock. There are two different <laughs> shades of purple. This is blue. This is purple. Maybe I'm colorblind. This is green. This is this is blue. Pastel green. That's lavender purple. Purple purple. Blue. Somewhere I failed in teaching you your colors. <laughs> <laughs> okay. This American is pink. You, you get that pink? Yeah. It's okay. Pink. Obviously that's pink. <laughs> no, really. Everyone's like this is blue. It's not. This is the same color that's on the thumbnail. That's purple. Yeah, this is a baby blue. It's just the light. Am I wrong? It's blue. It was like it's periwinkle. <laughs> it, it's blue. It's on the thumbnail. Purple periwinkle is basically blue. All right, well, whatever color it is, I'm going with pink because there's no denying that, right? Someone goes with turquoise. Turquoise is blue. This is this is green. Blue. Okay, all right. <laughs> let's just let's just let it go. <laughs> on which side you want to be on the outside. It's teal. This, <laughs> this side looks like it's knit, but if you flip the sock onto the other side, hey Freya, what's up? If you flip the sock to the other side, it looks like it's been crocheted. So I kind of like the crochet look over the knit look, so I'm gonna sew mine Well, how do they way. do that? I know, right? Socks are awesome. They're mysteries of nature. Okay, this so- not natural. I <laughs> flipped my sock. Out, uh, inside out, and then I got some matching thread. It's cold in here. It is getting cold, but they don't feel the cold, just we feel the cold. Okay, so I got my thread and I have my needle, and we're gonna make this in real time. Do I have a dull needle? Because you have an actual needle oh today. Gosh. So, <laughs> this is already straight. <laughs> I just broke my soul. <laughs> No injuries on TV. You get demonetized if you show blood. So I mean, I mean, it the skin, but it did not feel comfortable. All right. Here is we got a blanket. Oh yeah, we got some blankets. Somebody, okay, here, here we go. Oh, there we go. What? Where's your needle? Know where your needle is. Let's push that that way. Okay. Oh, is she just taking the the blanket? Okay. All right. I'll just sit here and suffer in silence. Okay. What's going on there? <laughs> He's putting that on your feet. Are we sharing? No, it's okay. I'm good. I'm good. My energy level keeps me warm. So, cut yourself some thread. Oh, the heater's on. Oh. Okay. What's up, Zoe? Here we go. We just made one of those little Japanese table things. What are they called? They're like in Japan and... um. There's a heater under the table. You want the blanket, you're gonna have to take it. You're messing up my hair. Then don't okay, have you just, just do it. You just do it. You just do it. I'm good. I'm gonna just oh, here. I choose more. I'm trying to give instructions. Okay, needle and thread. Needle. Go ahead and thread the needle. Wait, mine's already threaded, right? Yours is too short. You're gonna need longer thread. I, need to this for me. I didn't thread it ahead of time because I was working on my other video. Shout out to sisters. Uh, Lay, Leia, Lay. I think I got that. The blanket looks soft. It is super soft. I got it at Target, and there's Target only, sponsor us. There's only two left. I wanted like more. The only but... store I actually like besides oh. like Nike store and like obviously the favorites, but Target's like amazing too. Okay, so the little table with the heater underneath it and the blankets over it, genius. <laughs> it actually works. Just saying. You can't see it because it's up down there. But yeah, table, blanket, heater underneath. Keep an eye on it because you don't want it to catch fire because that would be bad, but it's totally working right now. 
All right, so I threaded my needle. I tied a knot in my end of my needle. Are you supposed to look at? I don't because these have humongous little opening eyes. Turn it on YouTube. It's okay, whatever. Um, <laughs> shout out to Bianca, sorry, Siri, what's up? All right, so thread your needle, tie a knot in the end. Wait, take you your sock. So, take your sock. You can tie a knot. No, I can't. Dude. Just because I seem smart doesn't mean I can tie a knot. <laughs> it's okay. You are smart. Not everybody can do everything. You can do things that I can't do. That's for sure. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Anyway. I did the edges. Turn around. Yes. Just that was me. She I did, did that. the edges. Mm -hmm. Loving it. Shout out to too. Ellen Miller. But her hair is like way better with gel. Yours is amazing. You're really good. Okay, so there's your knot. All right, you ready? Here's like so easy. What's up, Megan? How you doing? What's up, Jack? How you doing? This is how you doing. Shout out to Sky Albert Alberton. What's up? And Yo Neil? No, Mo Neil. What's up, Mo Neil? Okay, so I got my thread. I probably got way too much. If you get too much thread, it tangles a lot, so try not to get too much if you don't need it. All right, and I've got my sock. And this sock has the little decorative or ribbing part here. It stops, and then it turns into a different type of uh, knit or whatever socks are made out of. So I'm going to go about half an inch under that. Can you see this? About half an inch under that. And I'm going to take my needle, and I'm going to sew in and out. Let me see if I can sew backwards. There we go. And I'm just going through one side because I want to go all the way around the sock. All right, it's pretty easy, right? All right, now let's do it for real because I was doing that without looking. Okay. Like this. <laughs> My nose is running. Like this? What? Yeah, but you want to make sure you're going through just one side of the sock because you're going to pull it. So I actually put my fingers in the sock like this and then I go around it so that I don't catch the other side. But doing this method, you need to be careful not to poke yourself. Okay? Because getting stabbed with needles is not fun. Shout out to Noon Family. What's up? Shout out to Maria. What's up? So we're making mini beanies today because um, it's cold. <laughs> We need to do an ugly sweater. We have a video for an ugly sweater. And um, I was thinking about doing an Instagram party, like an ugly sweater Christmas or ugly sweater holiday party on Instagram. If you've got the gram, you can join us for that. I'll put out a little invite because we do one in real life. And I thought it'd be kind of fun to do one in the miniverse as well. So yeah, check out our Instagram later on and I'll try to post some details for that. Also, up until Christmas, um, I got my, my uh, 3D printer working, and we started doing something called flash giveaways, which is really weird. Thank you so much. Just a second. Ah, all right. Better. <laughs> <laughs> Never did that before. Hi, Elena. Um, so we did something, we're doing something called flash giveaways. The giveaways are only open for like an hour, two hours. The first one was three hours, but you don't know when I'm gonna post them. I'm trying to post them around the same time, but if whatever I print that day, we'll give away in a really fast little flash giveaway. So uh, check us out on Instagram during the holiday season for our flash giveaways. Hi, Shaylin, what's up? Shout out to I Heart Horses. Oh, that's such a cute name, I Heart Horses. You know what? I did this so much faster earlier when How I wasn't talking. How do you talking. do that? What are you talking about? You're just sewing in and out. Yeah, you're getting it. But if you sew too close to the edge, your beanie's going to be really, really long in the back, and you won't have enough to make a poof. The little pom-pom thing at the top. Um, shout out to Star Wars, the awesome fan. That is an awesome name. Did you hear our conversation earlier about Baby Yoda? Have you been watching The Mandalorian? Isn't Star Wars coming out this weekend? Wait a minute. We should have a new episode of Mandalorian today. It's Friday, right? The only reason I watch that show is for Baby Yoda. I know. Right? I don't even know what's happening. I live for the Baby Yoda scenes, and I don't understand why... He doesn't even talk! No, but sometimes he just leaves the baby! Like, why does he just leave the baby in the ship? I want to see what he looks like. I'm sorry, if you haven't been watching The Mandalorian, I'm probably giving so much away. But I was really upset the other day when he just left the baby. I'm like, it's a baby. 
It's not really a baby because it can do the force. And it's like smart and can walk around. It's more like a toddler. You know what you should do if you want to know what the guy looks like? Just look up the actor's name. I don't want to know what the Mandalorian dude looks I like. I want to know what he looks like. <laughs> okay. Yes, it's Friday the 13th. Hello, T. Oh my gosh, Watley74. How you doing? Hello, Victoria Beckham. I love not Victoria Beckham. <laughs> I'm going to forever think it's Victoria Beckham. What's up, Logan? Okay, so once you go all the way around, I'm still not looking at the camera, I'm looking at myself. Okay, once you go all the way around with that single stitch, go back through the loop, the, the knot, go right in right before the knot that you had tied earlier. Here we go, here we go, there we go. And you're just going to pull that, and it's going to gather it. You see that? Yay, we have a little gathered part there. Now I'm going to take this and wrap it around a couple of times. Wrap it around like this. Sorry, it takes a little bit of concentration for a hot minute here. You gotta pull it. And now that I've, yep, you gotta pull it together. Then you wrap it around. And after you wrapped it around, push the needle through the whole hat, but try to stay on the same line. This is the most dangerous part of this whole thing. So uh, try not to stab yourself in the finger. I'm saying this from experience because I've done it before and it's not fun. Okay, uh, what's up, Olivia? How you doing? How you doing, Rihanna? What's up? Your name is Sweet Peas World, but your name is Ariana. Sorry, I totally ruined that. Ariana, how you doing? Um, can you make ugly Christmas sweaters? We have a video for ugly Christmas sweaters. We do. It's already out there. And um, check it out on YouTube. You can probably check out our holiday playlist. I think we have a holiday playlist, which has tons of stuff in there. And we are working on... A video um, How do you for this? Monday for our ski lodge. So we're adding to it. So you, you want you wrapped it around a few times. Yeah. All right. You make sure always keep your string really really tight and taut, mm -hmm. and then you're gonna go through it all the way through. And this is just to lock the stitch in. So go in a few times, back and forth, just a few times. Like How always like that. Yeah, all the way through. Okay. Oh, I love you too. Oh, you love our new hairstyle. Thank you. Shout out to Anna. What's up? Can you please make a doll size reindeer headband? We did. There is a video for that on YouTube. Uh, we did that one last year, I believe. A whole bunch of different types of headbands. So go check that one out. I'll see if I can post a link on Instagram uh, for some of you as a reminder. Okay. So once you've gone through a few times, now I'm just going to tie and knot the end. And we are almost done with this beanie, y'all. It's like super easy. Could you make a hotel? That has been on the list for a while. All right, uh, Loretta, I know I need to do it. I know I need to do the hotel. I just haven't got around to it. <sighs> Time's so crazy. So where do you know? All right. Where's all your thread? It's in there. That, that's all you have? Oh, sweetie. <laughs> I messed up. <laughs> Okay, so we need enough thread to tie this off. Oh. All right, but maybe if we can just tie this right here into a little knot. <laughs> I can't even get that. All right, just tie that into a knot right there. How are you going to make me figure it out if you can't figure it out? <laughs> because <laughs> I'm doing instruction. Um, there we go. All right, so tie your ends of your string into a knot. And we are almost done with this. Shout out to Kay's Unicorn. What's up? Can you make a life-size Gudetama? Technically, a Gudetama is an egg. So our Gudetama Halloween costume is life-size. Technically, because he's an egg. He's little. Now, if you want to make like a humongous Gudetama, like the ones, the big plush, we can uh, try to do that. We can try, because that seems like fun, and I love plushies or felties or whatever you want to call them. Okay, so my that is cut. Let's cut the end of the string. Cut off the excess sock right above where the pattern changes. See here? We're gonna cut right there, okay? All right, right there, cut just like that. Mm. And then you can bunch the rest of this up to make your little puffs. You should make a hospital. Oh, we can make some hospital stuff if you like, like some fold-out rooms. We do have a hospital fold-out room that we made a while ago. 
months. But I guess we could update it. That was like years ago now that we made that. So I said, what what is your favorite what is your favorite hospital show? Favorite hospital show? Grey's Anatomy. The Resident. In my opinion, the Resident's better Grey's Anatomy. You know, the resident uses the high museum as the hospital it's, it's outside like, shot. It's literally, like, in Atlanta. Like, that's, like, the setting is in Atlanta. Yeah, and they, it was, the show even takes place in Atlanta. But they always show the high museum as the front of the hospital. The whole time I'm watching it. Maybe that's why I have a hard time watching it. You know when they... They're like, that's the museum. The lobby is the high museum, too. I know. Yeah. And I'm like, that's not a hospital. That's the high museum. You Will know? You cut it now? Yes, cut it. Trim off that little excess part there. <laughs> always cut away from yourself never towards yourself okay. and then you're going to cut right on this side to trim off the extra part okay you're almost done you're almost done with your craft Wait, you already... okay. alright and then you just mush this up here can you make a Grinch onesie I'm guessing that's just a green onesie like a fluffy green onesie do we need to stitch on a little heart I mean where it grows you okay oh fluff Wait, are you checking yourself out in the, in the camera? Yeah. Okay. All right, so there's a little puff. Then we're going to flip the bottom side up. <laughs> and ah! it's a beanie. And we got a little... Well, you, I have a little puff on mine, and you don't. So you can do it either way. So there it is. And if you want to turn this into an ornament, you can obviously put this on your dolls or your teddy bears or whatever it is that you collect or yourself. <laughs> and, or you can take it and add a hook and it's now a little christmas ornament oh, for your tree if you want a tree decorate it in beanies it just hooks right on there you go see Whoa. all right there's a craft for the day we made beanies in real time it only took 21 minutes <laughs> okay all right we want to talk to all of you now so let's definitely answer those questions. The Grinch one Z, Victoria Beckham, that is on the list. I will see if I can get it done. Don't know if I can get it done in time for the holidays. I can try. Um, when is the second episode coming out? Of Summer and Cali. Actually, that one is in the rotation. It should be shot um, either over the weekend or at the beginning of next week. So that one should hopefully come out next week. Hopefully. 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 Um, because we, I needed to finish up some stuff on the ski lodge before we shot the next episode of Summer in Cali, and that's where I'm at because the ski lodge is tied into that. I just totally gave that away. But that's what I'm doing, so I need to work on the ski lodge. Bella, do you have a boyfriend? <laughs> no! No! Okay, good to hear. Yay! I'm, just, I'm your I mom. Mean, I can't help it. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> Shout out to Nikki. What's up? Shout out to Ninja. What if I was like, what if I was like yeah, I do. That would be like awkward. Well, then it'd be like. I couldn't get in trouble though. Because no. it's all live. <laughs> live doesn't last forever. <laughs> <laughs> Just joking. <laughs> I'm not ready for that yet. I'm not ready for that either. I am life. not that responsible. Let me tell you. Um, I have my grades would drop <laughs> right now. Well, that's not good. I mean, so, at least I know that. That's not good. So I won't do it. Hi, Millie. What's up? Hey, Rebecca. What's up? Re 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 Rebecca. Someone Re said, Re Are you, do you have good grades? <laughs> she said, Strays and honors make me classes. Even though I only have four classes, so. But you know. I am so proud of you, though. Yay! She's so much smarter than I. Okay, so. I got all the pathways, you know what I'm saying? It's amazing in how your kids, like, surpass you. Because, you know, I was pretty excited. You know, I'm going to quit orchestra, so. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> I quit orchestra too, but I was like a junior. Orchestra is lame. I, I quit orchestra my junior year. But um, I was a straight A student in high school. Like, the entire time. Never made a B. Straight A student. And then here you are. Straight A student. I mean, I had, an oh, for, I had an 89 for a second. But, you, but not now. Hey, an A is an A. I, I, I don't split Apparently, hairs. they're not now. Like, what? an A minus and an A plus is, like, different. Uh, when it comes to GPA, it's just going to be a four. Oh, my. You know. And that's what matters. Hey. So I'm just really happy because you're taking AP classes and I didn't take AP. I took honors classes, but you're taking AP classes. I'm taking AP so, chemistry as a, fr as a sophomore next year. So that's really awesome. I'm really, really proud of you. Okay, yeah. let me stop gushing because I'm all emotional right now. I'm so proud of my baby. Okay, what, what time is it? It is 7.24. Yes, 7.24. Someone said, how do you do your edges? Uh, I ask her. Gel? <laughs> 
I use Ego Gel and I use a little bit of Edge Control. I forgot the brands. I don't know, but I, didn't, I don't use Edge Control. You don't need to. <laughs> it just, it, just stays. It does like weird stuff on me, so I don't know what that is. I use a little bit of Edge Control to keep it in place. Then you just take a toothbrush and you swoop. Yasmin 1466 loves our locks. Thank you. Thank you. And give a shout out to Cupcake Boss 2008. What's up? All right, are you going to review the new Barbie Fashionistas? I haven't seen them in stores yet. So as soon as I see them in stores, I will definitely get on that. Um, it's just so much more fun to find them in stores. I know I could shop online, but I actually enjoy looking for them. Yeah, dragging me along, taking us to Walmart, staying at Walmart for three hours. <laughs> in the toilet over. Don't make it sound like you oh don't enjoy God. it. I mean, I do. I like it at Target because at Target, when we, me and my brother will go into the furniture aisle and we will take Let's out the not furniture. Not incriminate ourselves. We take out the furniture from the shelves. And okay. We sit on yeah. The so yeah. Blah, 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 blah. Okay. <laughs> Let's not tell the Target employees what we be doing. Okay. <laughs> um, Where did you get your hoops? You got it from icing. Right. Yes, I think we got these. No, was it Claire's? Icing. Was it icing? Or Claire's. Same thing. One of those stores. Icing or Claire's. Um, are you ever going to stop YouTube? I hope not. I, I certainly hope Hopefully not. Hopefully YouTube never stops us. <laughs> That's the question. <laughs> <laughs> YouTube, like, canceled. No, uh, I hope not. I, I enjoy being here. I love being here with all of you. I think that said Ellie. What's up, Ellie? Have we seen Frozen 2 yet? No. I have not been to I have not, but I have seen clips, and another new song, and her hair is out. I am so bad. I just haven't had a chance. I haven't even seen Maleficent 2 yet, y'all, and that's the movie, like, I've been wanting to see all year, and I have not gone back to that. Tourist Arrest is back. I know there's one in, like, uh, New Jersey, right? Am I wrong? Yeah. I don't know, but I can't wait to see it, and hopefully we'll get to see it if we go up to Toy Fair this year. We might get to go to Toys R Us, because we don't have one yet here uh, by us. It better be like three stories. I, it just looks totally different. It's kind of like, it, it, from the pictures, no, it doesn't look like your old Toys R Us. It's like an experience. Oh. Kind of like, like a American Girl store. Candy No, no, no. No, it's like or a store, but it's like, yeah, set up kind of crazy. What is going on with that one? Do you see that one? What's your favorite food ever? Favorite food ever? I don't know. What about you? Ramen. Or probably not. I like pancakes. I like pancakes. And, but I also like apple butter. I like pancakes with bananas and avocado. Bro, that's I good. Like, and like dates. Butter. Bro, that's good. Uh, yeah. Wanna have pancakes tonight? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> We know we're trying to still name Bella and Oprah. Yeah, because I had these names. Or would, you not, would you not name us like having the same letter for no, names? You wouldn't no. do that to your twins? Not, not a boy and girl. If I had two boys, I had Damon and Damien. That's too close. <laughs> That's like way too close. But uh, what's up, Eddie? How you doing? That's way too close. I would not. I don't know. I like Bella and Noah as twins. Bella and Noah. Me and Noah are definitely not twins. They're not Maybe twins. Like... It, it, Noah's amazing like Noah is so smart and he's so talented he like does little animations and stuff but he does not want to be on camera at all and so we respect that like you're yeah. okay with it she's like yeah I'll do it I'll do whatever I've been doing Noah's, it forever Noah's like nope don't nope like, you try to take a know, picture of Noah and he's like this probably smiling and then you see him and you're like <laughs> I have pictures of him literally like I know I was like come on you're so adorable please smile he's like I am smiling mom I am smiling I go like so, you just let Noah do what he wants to do. But I love the names that I picked out. So, it was twins, boy and girl, it's going to be Bella and Noah. Who is Army? I am Army. Army! Forever! Uh, if someone wants to know, do you both like sewing? I love sewing. What are your actual real thoughts I think on it's sewing? cool when other people do it. When I do it, it doesn't turn out the way I want it to. So, I just don't do it. <laughs> well, there you go. You know, it's not for it's everyone. It's like painting. I don't paint. The other people paint and it's cool, but I don't paint. I literally, that's the one thing I can't do when it comes to art. But paint. you know, it, it's like you, you, the more you do it, the better you get. It's you have, like anything in life. You have to practice. Painting is expensive. It is. Is it cold where you live? Yes. Unfortunately. Yes. Man, I was about to be like, I'm, move, I'm moving to Arizona. Like, I can't deal with this anymore. 
And then you'd be complaining about the heat. Because we lived in Arizona for a while, and it was literally so hot during the day that you couldn't go outside. Like, at Arizona's all. Arizona's cheap, though. I don't know if it's cheap. No, it's like, I don't remember it being cheap. <laughs> it's like the desert. I know, but there's like a giant city there. Like, Scottsdale and... Uh, Phoenix. We were we were by Glendale. We were over in the Glendale area, and it was so hot. Like we literally only went outside to play at night. You don't remember that, do you? No. You I in school lo- yet? I I want to live in Arizona or Germany, which is completely different climates. But you know, yeah. Stephen wants to know how long we've we been on YouTube. Um, I have been I have been doing YouTube for over ten years, but we've been my froggy stuff for nine years, about to be. Uh, 10 next year will make 10 years for my froggy stuff but I've been on YouTube for probably about how old are you? 14 then I've been doing YouTube for 11 years yes who's your favorite BTS member? Kim Young. forever and ever and ever bro he's my bias and my bias record I don't even only Tang stands can relate bro only Tang stands can relate shout out to Leia what's up? what do you do to make yourself feel better? Listen, I don't to Jaden Smith. I don't like you kind of sometimes. <laughs> That's from last week, okay? Or is like that how you feel now? <laughs> Wait, did they say that last week? I, I thought, yeah, someone said I don't like you kind of sometimes. <laughs> and then they saw it again. I like you kind of always. Why does your eye gravitate towards negative comments? Okay, I'm, okay, positive only. Who edits your, no, what do you use to edit your videos? I have no clue because mm. I don't edit my videos. Me neither. Um, my husband edits my videos, so I guess we could try to ask him what he uses. Uh, shout out to Winter Robinson. Robinson, what's up? Shout out to Sarah H. What's up? Oh, you're beautiful. I love you. What's your favorite color? My favorite color is... Okay, I love to wear black. My house is blue. And I love to look at the color green. Even though lately I have this crazy affection for hot pink. Like, I have to have it somewhere like i wear black jeans but then i have like a hot pink top or hot pink shoes i used to hate purple but now i like purple and subtle like purple shoes but then the shirt would have purple in it but yeah. not a purple shirt purple ish like something something with purple in it and then i like purple shoes but then um well, only purple air ones Maybe. what are your thoughts on melanie martinez i don't listen to her i saw a picture of like decapitated dolls once and I think that bothered me. But um, that's pretty much all I know. So. Do you listen to Billie Eilish? I actually do listen to Billie Eilish. I, I don't want to say, okay, I don't want to say I listen to Billie Eilish now. I listen to some of her songs. I listen to Ocean Eyes. Ocean Eyes is really good. Uh, when the Party's Over, really good. Everything I Wanted was really, that's a really good song. Um, so she listens to some Billie Eilish. Yeah, more, okay. more like her popular songs. I don't like go in her albums and like find stuff. Um... What, have you seen the new BTS prestige prestige dogs? Yes, I have. I've seen them all over Instagram. Uh, Nefra Forever has like a ton of really amazing photos, and I believe Hexlens also has some great photos on Instagram. I don't have them because I just haven't bought a lot of dolls lately. Um, I got a little backlog <laughs> that I haven't got to yet, so I haven't seen it. But I, mean, I don't have them, but I have seen them. So yeah. Make a snowman. We have a video for a snowman. I believe we made it out of toilet paper, so you want to go check that video out. What is Someone your said, thought? No, what is your thought on rats? Rats? Rats are rats. And that's period. Okay, so we were in New York. <laughs> no, I don't get it. Because <laughs> here we call, like, kids play at school who were like, oh, it's like, someone says there's a rat, right? That means, like, it's, like, annoying. And then I rats, rats are, are, like, people who, like, double cross you. Like, well, oh, yeah, that too. But, like, the like, rats are rats, because rats get it no it was kind of better in my head <laughs> um i think rats are great on television i love watching them run Red through too is great like when people who build these giant houses for their rats i think that's amazing i love I mean, that hamsters hamsters are people rats. do have rats too like, you know I tell you tell you something my cousin's boat. dog is literally a rat <laughs> I hope they're not watching. <laughs> but when we were in New York and we were walking through Central Park, a rat literally ran across the path and I freaked Bro, out. We heard and people like will tell you, like you go to like a restaurant, people will tell you that like if you kick the trash ca- if you kick the trash bags, then like rats will like crawl out of the trash bags. Like it's insane. New York in the summer is 
kind of disgusting. Like, a little bit. It but smells... To anyone in New York, do not listen to her. Everyone's allowed to have their own opinion. Everybody in New York knows Everyone's this. Everyone's allowed to have their own opinion, but... Seeing a rat in real life, in person, outside of a cute little cage, is a whole experience. Rats aren't cute in general. The ones with the, but I'll tell you something, the ones with the red eyes, those oh, ones do look dope. See, no, the tail is what gets me, because it looks like a, like a pointy it's worm. It's like a worm, And yeah. it's just like, they're... If they had fuzzy tails, imagine if they had fuzzy tails or like chinchilla tails. Because uh, chinchillas are basically just big rats. Ayana and Moose... I think they're gonna moose. Uh, they probably don't like to talk about rats. Okay, I'm sorry. Okay, so rats are awesome. If you like rats, I'm just not a rat person. There we go. <laughs> uh, can you make an elf on the shelf for the for the Darbies? We have a video for an elf on the shelf. We do. We have little tiny ones. And if you watched the Darby Show graduation, you would see that we had the little elves in there featured. So, and there's a little printable book of the elves. All that's out there. So yeah. We have that. Share your beauty secrets with us. I don't have beauty secrets. Genetics. You stop. No, okay. Look, look at. I mean, like, look. We don't look anything alike, but I would say I did not get skipped. Even though, if you like, compare me to my brother, I did. But stop it, you. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so what I do for uh, my skin? T- I can take what I do. Okay, this is what I do. I moisture like soda. Baking soda is like forever i scrub microdermabrasia type thing i like i moisturize my not moisturize but i scrub my face every single night with baking soda and i use uh juice beauty age defying moisturizer which is a little pricey but i love it and it smells like apples and that's pretty much all i do yep favorite comedian hassan minhaj and trevor noah <laughs> okay i can watch them all day every day i do watch them all day every day I don't have a favorite comedian. Um, what's your next craft? No. What's your next craft? Well, this weekend we have a video coming out uh, with seven ways to reuse the tube that the Barbie uh, reveal I forgot, comes out. And so we have that video and there's a couple crafts in there. But then we are, right now I'm working on some stuff to go with the ski lodge. So that will be after that video. Favorite Starbucks drink? It used to be the chai iced latte with almond milk, but literally tear destroys my stomach. So um, now it's passion tea. Yes. No, unsweetened passion tea. Unsweetened passion tea. Same, same here. Ice. Same here. No, no ice though. I don't, you don't like ice. ice. I don't like ice. What grade are you in? I'm in ninth grade, but I want to graduate. Shout out to Eden Filner. Filner. Cakes. Up? I eat pancakes every day. Oh! <laughs> Pancakes are awesome. Our pancakes are different, though. You might, I mean, because we have no oil in our pancakes. What's your favorite Chinese food? Um, I don't think I have Chinese. Yeah, we haven't had Chinese. We have a lot of. We used to have a lot of Japanese. Oh, every once in a while we'll splurge, and we—that's not Chinese. Japanese. I was gonna say the little pot stickers. That's not Chinese, is it? Though. I mean, they do have Chinese pot stickers. I don't. I don't know where they originated, so I'm not going to say anything. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> uh, Eli Tucker, you're awesome. Shout out. Oh, the names are fading away. Okay, so I'm like trying to read stuff, and as it goes up, it just fades into oblivion, and I can't see it. Uh, uh, Adra, what's up? Tiffany. Said, do you like pho? I actually don't like pho. Is, it, is that how you say it? Pho, yeah. Oh, I thought it was pho. pho. You thought it was pho. Pho. I don't know. <laughs> You're so American. <laughs> I, I am American, okay? <laughs> Sorry. I um I don't think I've ever had it. Pho? Yeah. I've had it. Uh, toy, do you want more kids? No. <laughs> That's an easy question. <laughs> My kids are all, like, able to be self-sufficient. And we can, like, stay in the house by ourselves. They can stay home by themselves. And so, yeah, I'm, I'm good. <laughs> Someone said, what is your funniest at-home experience? Uh, funniest at like home being experience. a home alone experience. I don't know. Like I guess What's your funniest, funniest home alone experience. My funniest. They're not usually funny. Really? I usually get injured. Really? Yeah, because when I Maybe ran to surf down the stairs of mattresses, <laughs> it's the getting injured part. <laughs> so when I was little, this is never do this. Okay, this is bad. But we, my parents would go away and they'd look at work and my parents worked long hours when I was little. And so me and my brothers would take all the cushions off the couch and put them down the stairs. And then we get a piece of cardboard, and we slide downstairs. 
into the cushions. But is it, is it the same house that they're in right now? Yes, it is. So the door is right next to the stairs. Yes, it is. <laughs> <laughs> and it was bad. Did you go head first? Huh? Did you go head first? I don't remember, but because your head is flying into the door, I, I probably hit my head a few times. I don't remember, but it was really bad. It was dangerous, and I think I like fractured my foot one time. I didn't tell my parents. Is yeah. it healed? I don't know. <laughs> it was bad, and then as an adult, when y'all were gone, that's when I ran into the wall and I jacked up my foot and had to go to the hospital. Whoa. See, so I shouldn't be home by myself. <laughs> Not good. Uh, my funniest at home home alone experience was I think it was like literally last week. Like we were home alone, right? And then like there was a knock on the door, and so me and Noah we like hid. <laughs> we didn't really know who we didn't know who it was. We just like like scrammed, right? So we were like hiding like behind the wall. There's a wall between the door and you know the wall. We were hiding, right? And then like we were just waiting for that person to leave, and the person like didn't leave. I think they dropped a box. I think it was a post office. Person. Oh, the post. Okay. And they like, but they just wouldn't leave. So like, they were there for like 15 minutes and we were just like sitting there hiding and then we, like, they heard them walk away and I looked at him and he was like, oh no, he's gone. That's, it was kind of terrifying. Well, you know, we have a camera on the door. Yeah. So we, we can see who's at the door and we probably talk to them and tell them. We were literally but... just a post office, like, waiting there. Like, why are you, like, just leave, man. <laughs> Okay, that's not funny, but okay. Favorite Doctor from Doctor Who? Uh, the Converse. 11th and the... What? Converse. That's the 11th Doctor. Yeah. So the 11th and the 12th. Well, but then the... No, no, no. It's the 10th and 11th. The one 10th with and 11th. The tall one with the nice hair. Matt Smith? The tall one with the nice hair. Not the one with spiky hair, but the nice hair. I think you think about Matt Smith. He had a bow tie? He had Converse, right? No, that was the one with spiky the hair. The 10th had the Converse. The other one had the bow tie. And yeah. little, and little feds hat thingy that he would wear. But yeah, he would have he had really nice hair. And he had like a jawline. I don't know. That was I think his name was Matt Smith. But those two were my favorite doctors. Um, okay, what country do you dream of visiting? I want to go to the UK so bad. Um, haven't gone, and that's where I want to go to the UK. I want to go see the palace. I want to take that picture in front of the palace. I want to go find a police box. Because that's like goals. Don't they don't exist anymore. I think there's like one. I don't know. But I need to go find that. So that's my, my dream vacation. What about you? Um, either Australia. And I know I kind of kind don't want to. But I kind of do want to. Either Australia or um, or like uh, South Korea or Germany. Okay. Actually not Germany. Amsterdam. Nice. And Grace has been all over the world. That's amazing. I've um, been to parts of the world. I just haven't been all over the whole world. I've been to Turkey. I've been to Japan. What's, What's your favorite thing? amusement park? Six Flags is cool. Six Flags is good rides. It's like a lot of roller coasters, but the employees are like miserable. Okay, don't say that. <laughs> um, <laughs> sorry, Six Flags. She knows not what she says. Uh, <laughs> Disneyland. Oh, and yeah. Universal. 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 No. Okay, Disneyland and Universal. Disneyland, okay, di no, 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 not Disneyland. Disney World. Disney World. Disney World or Universal? Both. But Universal and Orlando. I am not Orlando. Disney. Universal. Universal and Orlando. Universal and Orlando or Universal and Hollywood? Universal and Orlando. Disneyland. Universal and Orlando, Disneyland Disney, Disney, Disney World. World. Disney, Disney World. World Disney goes World. crazy. It's huge. But you can walk all of Disneyland, which is cool. You can literally, like, walk the entire thing. What? Disneyland? Yes, we were able to do Disneyland in one day. We were able to do Universal but you in Hollywood can't do all one day. World. But Disney World, no, you can't do it in one day. And this trash smells like cinnamon sugar. But I will say Universal, okay, Disneyland is very, like, everything, like, kind of blends into each other, you know what I'm saying? It's like a, like a world, and, but Universal is, like, you, you don't have, like, the, like, it doesn't feel like a village, but it's very, like. Well, it has segmented spots. Yeah, yeah. like, The Simpsons. Yeah. That thing was, but is The Simpsons owned by Disney now? Simpsons are owned by Disney now, yes. So do you have to take that part? I have no idea what's going to happen <laughs> with that. Do you like pugs? Yes, they're adorable. Little dogs. As long as someone else owns them. Face, like I, them. I won't own a pug, but I, I love to look at them on my television. Things are always better when they're on TV. Yeah. <laughs> Not always. You know, but yeah. When it comes what to animals. Your dog breed? My favorite dog breed is my cockapoo. I like Dobermans. Okay, let's not talk about I like the dogs. big Dobermans. That, like, yeah, Dobermans. And I, those are some pretty dogs. It's still too soon. 
talk about dogs. Wild Warriors are pretty dogs too. Listen, you're crazy. You're not here. My morning here. I'm literally gonna start crying. Okay, so, okay, so <laughs> do you like loft beds? Uh, Lofts aren't they uncomfortable? I don't know, but let me. I like. We made a couple in videos, and I think they're pretty cool. Uh, I wouldn't have one in my own house though because I would fall off. That's just me. <laughs> I'm that accident prone. Yes. So, uh, shout out to Ryan Buchanan. It's your birthday. What's up? And we were just told that we would, we're at 44 minutes. Wow. So, hmm. time to wrap it up. Time to just do the wrap up part. Will you do meet and greet? Yes. Just give me some time to work all that look, out. I look like you now. I don't look like that. Cheekbones. My cheekbones don't look like that. No, I do. You like. I don't look like that. <laughs> Whatever. Okay, yes, we can try to do a shout out. Happy birthday to Martha Bryant. What's up? And um, shout out in Atlanta. There is an Atlanta doll show. I'm going to see if I can find a way to get in touch with those people and possibly do a meet and greet in conjunction with that. If not, we'll just do something really impromptu. Like, hey, let's just meet at the American Girl store mm, outside in front and try not to get caught by police. Yeah, we'll do that. Um, so let so me said Billie work Eilish on that. Crafts. How would you even do a Billie Eilish craft? Eilish craft. Like she has like, like that one, that one. I think he just needs. Doesn't she have like green hair? Now she does. But it, it was, There's a Barbie doll always like that. Her. There's a Barbie fashionista already has green. She hair. had like green roots. Oh, I'm saying like she just won a music video where she's like has like a, these demon wings. Okay, we're, we're literally running over on time. Right. Okay, <laughs> lights are gonna start cutting off. Everything that's battery operated since I shutting off on front of us. Okay, okay. Shout, out. shout out time. Here we go. We want to give a shout out. I'm just gonna look at the screen. Here we go. Let's just. Uh, Zipporah. What's up? Tegan. I'm, I'm sorry. Tiana. Tiana. What's up? What's up, Amari's Tiana? Khan. What's up? You're going too fast. <laughs> Jade All Six. What's up? Next Beauty 89. What's up? Uh, Elise P. What's up? Samar Ahmed. What's up? Uh, Carol Remix 24. What's up? Diva with a little animal face. What's up? Emily Jane. What's up? Um, Super Sophie. What's up? Uh, Mod the Devereaux. What's up? Mod of Vibes. What's up? Addie. What's up? Uh, Sonia Peach, did our upload schedule change? No, it is not. So during the week, if we upload a video between Monday and Thursday, it, it'll be uploaded at 4. We mainly uploading recently on a Monday, Wednesday. And then on Fridays, we do YouTube Live at 7. And then on Saturdays or Sundays, if we upload a video on a Sunday, they will be always posted at 11. But right now, it's kind of like a Monday, Wednesday, Friday, Saturday is the current schedule at the moment. All right, Elizabeth... <laughs> what's up? Uh, Winter Robinson. What's up? Breezy Cheetah. What's up? Sophia, Sophia Steele. What's up? Our Kids Rock. What's up? George C. What's up? Brian the Banana Pop Productions. What's up? Hey, lazy Potato Being Lazy. What's up? <laughs> so cute. Uh, Amber Ma Turn. <laughs> what's up? Oh, two more, Macy Kelly. What's up? And Bella, Bella Font. What's, What's up? up? Like, comment, share, and subscribe. Make sure to follow us on Instagram at my froggy stuff and the frog vlog, and follow me on Instagram at Bella of my froggy stuff. I'm really inactive, but I post every once in a while. So, <laughs> if you make a mini beanie, post a pic on Instagram using hashtag my froggy stuff fan pics. We love to see what all of you out there are creating. Thank you for joining us, and we can't wait to see you next week. And uh, yeah, that's it, right? Yep. Bye. See you next time. Bye.